Looker is a mysterious character introduced back in Pokemon Platinum. Since then, he has showed up on all the games up to the just released Pokemon Auras. He has played a key role in every game. But what if I told you that he has been with us since way before Platinum? Are you guys ready for another crazy Pokemon theory? First, we need to establish who Looker is. Well, at least little we know about him. The first time we encounter him is in Jubilife City. Apparently, we are so good that we unmask his secret identity. What is very interesting about our encounters with Looker throughout Sinnoh is that we learn that he's an officer from the international police. Also, I want you to note that his grammar was horrible, which implies that he was not native to the region, therefore not fluent in the local language. Looker makes a comeback during our playthrough Unova, and this time he's on a mission to arrest all seven sages that have caused so much trouble, still establishing that strong connection as a detective for the international police. Next time we meet Looker is actually in Kalos, and this time he is after Zerosek, who is second in command of Team Flare, and also one of the crazy scientists. This time his event is much larger than any other time in previous games, but even so, there is very little revealed regarding his origin and how he became what he is then. So now that Auras is out, he makes yet another appearance, but this time is very briefly and has left us all baffled. We'd meet him at the battle resort, and this time he suffers from amnesia due to an unknown reason, and he's washed up short. He's soaking wet. A woman brought him to her cottage to dry himself up. At the cottage we'd get an auto night, and so far that's all we got. At this point many theories have surfaced, and some of them talk about Looker being a Time Lord and having a connection to Hoopa. Fans claim that we find him at the beach with Amnesia because Hoopa teleported him there, which could eventually lead to a future DLC event, which sounds reasonable but I have found no evidence to support it. But I see this a different way. If Looker was washed up on the beach, it seems more reasonable that he was in the ocean, perhaps in a boat, and somehow he fell off the boat, or maybe even the boat sank, and he hit his head and ended up with amnesia. Don't you guys agree? In Unova, the most famous ship is the Royal Unova. So my guess is that he's traveling in the boat, and then the accident that I described earlier happened. Everything makes sense, so case closed, right? Not yet, Pokemon theories. There is one more piece of evidence that we need to take a look at. In Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, the Oceanic Museum in Stelport City has a motto of the SSN and the Royal Unova. The SSN has a text that explains how it is now sailing around the world, while the Royal Unova text says that it is currently under construction and will be completed in an X amount of years. Do you guys know what this means? It means that Auras takes place before Unova, and that the looker we meet at the battle resort has never encountered the seven sages. Perhaps this looker event comes previous to the one in Pokemon Platinum. But how can this be? Looker must have fell off a boat. But the only boat around is the SSN. Wait a minute. Can it be? No way. You guys decide. <laughs>